Here is Luberico UK, the Swiss fruit plant producers and breeders. My name is Markus Kobold, I'm breeder and founder of Lubera. Today I want to pre present you a new pair, Lubera's royal pair. And this pair, you see it here in my hand, and I have not a small hand, is really a royal pair. In form, in size, and in the dark red royal, almost purple, uh, color. But what makes this pair so special? It's not only the size, it's not only the color, it's really the enjoyment it gives when you are eating it. And of course, normally you are not eating this type of pear, you are enjoying it. So I want to show you how to enjoy Lubera's royal pear. So first, of course, after, after uh, picking this pear, middle end of September, you have to store it. You store it in a box, you store it in your cellar, and uh, till Christmas or short after Christmas you take it out of your cellar, of your box and you do it in your fruit bowl together with other fruit, together with bananas and after four to five, six days it, be it ripens. It becomes ripe and it becomes, becomes good to eat. You can test it if you, if you make a little pressure with your thumb here on and if you remark that uh, it becomes a little bit of soft, that it's reacting a little bit, then it's the right time to enjoy it. So this pair here, this royal pair, is now in the right time to enjoy. Not just to eat, to enjoy it. So we cut it vertically in the middle, as usually. And oh, delicious. So it's, it's yellow-white. And it's full, full of juice. I want to show you uh, the fruit with the juice. Delicious. You see the juice? Yeah. Mmm. Mount watering. Really, this type of pear. Lubera's royal pear. So, how to eat Lubera's royal pear? It's the first and only pear which has to be eaten with a spoon. Also, citizens like me have to eat this royal pear with a spoon. Because only with a spoon you show your respect against this royal pear. First, you take out the seeds in the middle. So out and already the hole we have done here is full of juice. You see this is the truly sign that that uh, the pear is ready to be enjoyed to be eaten. And then eating. First the smell it's delicious. It's pear it's pear by two it's perfect and then you take the flesh. With the spoon, of course. As I've said also, citizens like me have to eat to enjoy this royal pear with a spoon. It's like butter. It's going away suddenly and it's only juice and flavor. The flavor, the perfect flavor of pear. No, almost no structure in your mouth. It's going away suddenly and the rest is only enjoyment and and juice. Delicious. Also as a citizen who shows his respect uh, towards this royal pear by eating it with a spoon. In the end I always enjoy also to eat a little bit of this pear with the whole fruit and uh, I hope no royal will see this because it gives also a little added, added value to it the 
fruit, the pear becomes a little bit more fruity uh, if you eat it wholly. But to begin with, and uh, to have really the enjoyment of this pear, you have really to eat it first with a spoon and to end a little bit to eat it totally. Yeah, it's a little bit more fruity like this, but with a spoon, it's it's really it's really perfect. Mm. So it's so easy to eat it with a spoon. It's really really easy thing, and uh, yeah. The royal pear by Lubera, Lubera's royal pear, is really the first and only pear which has to be eaten with a spoon. So these were some information about how to enjoy, not to say how to eat, how to enjoy Lubera's new royal pear. I hope you enjoyed it too. Uh, don't believe everything I'm telling you, but most of it. Uh, like always, discuss with us below in the commentaries. And go on gardening and go on enjoying the fruit of your gardening work. Thank you very much. Hope nobody has seen this. <laughs>